My father, one day, he's going to die and think, wow, I raised the faggot. I'm a single child, by the way. Ha <laughs> ha! That just gave me a nice hard lesson telling me, hey, you know what? Some people just aren't going to like you, no matter how badly I want them to like me. Ross Dog, I want you to like me. Ian Ellis, love me. Gay Guitar Guy, love me. Hip Star, love me. You know who these people are? They're my internet friends. It's kind of cringe and gay, right? But it just seems like sometimes I just can't perform up to that aptitude. Look, I may be gay for this, but I have respect for every listener, for every view that I get. And with that respect, I say, hey, I want to be saying something worth the fuck. I want to be interesting. I want to be funny. Now, I may not be insightful, interesting, or funny all the fucking time, but the effort's there. And I feel like there's a lot of fucking internet personas out there that don't share the same respect for their viewership. For example, Focus CDS. All right? I went ahead and hosted a live stream called With Apologies about a few days ago for my good friend Ian Ellis. That is his television show. He went on and did his show. I made a joke about Focus CDS. Focus CDS then decides to respond in a chat for some reason and say, well, this is why I can't be friends with Jinx because blah, 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 over a joke, okay? And then he decides to call on the live stream. What did Jinx and things do when Focus CDS called on to the live stream? I turned him down from 80% to about 60 or so percent. And then I decided to talk over him. I did not want to have a back and forth with that motherfucker. You know why? Because he doesn't have respect for his audience. He decides that having little lukewarm talking points, little fucking verbal crutches is a good thing to be when you want to broadcast yourself to the internet. What do I mean by verbal crutches? Oh, I mean, oh, at the end of the day, it's all love. Hey, everyone got 24 hours. You got 24 hours. I got 24 hours. Hey, man, it's all good. It's all good. It's like, I go on the internet because, like, I, I just don't meet that many abnormal personas out there. You know, I don't go on the internet and want to talk to my coworkers. With Focus CDS, I'm talking to my coworker. He's not employed. That's neither here nor there. It's kind of like, you know, you get the gist, right? What does Jinx and Things do? He's a faggot sometimes. He gets anxious. He gets emotional and gay. Like, whatever. Fine. Take it or leave it, dummy. What? You don't gotta watch this shit, you silly cow. You know what's funny? Out of my whole sphere of friends and live streamers and viewers and stuff, I'm the only one actually giving nice, great, insightful advice about lifting, actually giving something back to the community. Oh, like, oh, hey, here, here's my sights about uh, the squad and blah, blah, blah. I love the squad. I could talk about it for thousands of hours. And, what, and who are my uh, competents? Who do I have to rub shoulders with? A fucking gossip queen? A fucking little bitch that goes on the corner. And goes, oh, hey, did you hear that Molly Go Lightly did this? Oh, hey, did you hear that True Crime did this? Oh, hey, did you hear that this guy dogs this guy? Then that guy's going to dox this? Hey, hey, blah, 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 blah. Who am I talking about in particular? Ross Dog. Ross Dog. Ross Dog. Right. Wow. Wow. Oh, wow. Jeans and thanks to Ross Dog. And what is this? 2018 uh, Ross Dog Internet? He went from pretty much trying to be a junior with apologies like we are with Sue Party. And now what is he? He's a little gossip queen. But... I think what it is, is he doesn't have the same respect that he used to have from his peers that did the live streams with him, that, that were just the Junior with Apology streams, just the, you know, talking shit, just the, you know, making jokes, barbs, blah. He doesn't have the same respect from those guys because most people can't, uh, they, they would have to watch like thousands of hours of uh, backtrack to even understand what's going on with the, with the new drama, with the new gossip, with the new tea, sis. And he's been mad at me for a very long time. Why? I don't know. I call him boring. I call him lame. I call him autumn. I call him all kinds of things. I call him moon man. I call him jet plane. Right? So what? You're fucking boring. I'm monotone and gay. So fucking what? Some people just don't have to like you, motherfucker. And they just always little slight jabs. Always little slight jabs. Look, motherfucker. We're not jabbing at you. The jings of things, the gay guitar guy, the suit party, the hip star. No one fucking gives a fuck about you. No one's fucking mentioning. But for some fucking reason, jings of things always has to be in your fucking mouth. 
Maybe it's because I'm everything that you want her to be. Maybe it's because I can go on live streams for two or three hours, talk about nothing. I'm just goddamn fucking Larry Clark, Larry Bruce, Jerry Seinfeld and this motherfucker. I can just talk. I don't have to, and, and you know, I don't have to pander to a viewership that wouldn't give a fuck about me if I wasn't fucking talking about Starlight or whatever. You, on the other hand, you lost your capability to be funny. You can't stop pandering to the true crime community. And you're a little sussy boy faggot. You're the emotional one. No, you. No, you. You're a little fucking nitpick. Let me rewind. Like I said, I hosted with apologies for Ian Ellis a few days ago. Focus, I make fun of Focus CDS. Focus CDS doesn't like that. He decides to call on the show. What do I do? I turn him down. I overtalk him. Why? Because I don't want to go back and forth with him. It's so fucking gay. It's so fucking dumb. Incel, gay, incel, gay, incel, gay, incel, gay, incel, gay, incel, uh, uh. Oh, fuck. Wow, I can't believe. You don't believe me? Go watch the fucking Focus CDS show and, t and tell me about the humorous, amazing back and forth and banter that fucking Focus can do. You just live in your mom's basement. You don't make any money. You get nothing for Christmas. Man, 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 man. I'm a real man. You're not a real man. I'm not a real man. You're not a real man. Of course I over talk that shit. I don't want to fucking entertain that shit. And honestly, I hate Ian Ellis. I hate the whole with apologies. I hate all you motherfuckers for even allowing this motherfucker to have this fucking kind of behavior. He has been a little better. But you know what? I think it's because with apologies has been on a decline for a while. Well, uh, Helen doesn't stream, Rex, Cosmic, all the fucking big shotters, big heavy hitters are fucking gone. And then so what? Now we have Focus CDS. Focus CDS wouldn't have been around if uh, around with apologies five years ago. He would have fucking rage quit it. He would have been fucked off and we wouldn't have to fucking see that shit. But you know what? Hey, every now and then he does host a nice ass stream yard that fucking Ian Ellis can go on because he doesn't want to host his own show and stuff. So I guess that's why he's on. You're a literal mic stand, Focus. Ross dog. Baby, come on, dude. It's me, dude. It's me, Jinx of Things. Come on, fella. Why can't we be friends, huh? I just call you boring, okay? Oh. So what? You wanna nitpick every little fucking thing that I do? Go, I, I got I got hundreds of hours of soup pie. They can go nitpick through and, and, and say, oh, 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 hey guys. Hey, at hour 47, Jesus thinks I did this. And this, so I go respond to him and they say this. But then Jesus thinks said this and then I said this and then Jesus said that and that. And then so I set the squish out at the docks and there. This is what happened. Is, uh, I felt so gay even like, because, you know, like, gay guitar guy likes making fun of you and stuff, but then I was like, no, this is way too of a nitpick to even try to, like, make fun of or whatever. You know? So I was like, fuck that. I'm not doing that. It's fucking dumb. I'll look like a girl responding to it. But you know what? I'm the girl responding to it now. <laughs> whatever, dude. My dad's gonna fucking die thinking I'm a fucking faggot. Some internet people want to think that I'm fucking gay and stupid too, then fucking so be it. Whatever.